So for me, systems engineering is about the ability to think holistically about a problem. System engineering gives me the chance to look at a bigger picture and see the real interconnection between every component of a project. There is no better feeling than graduating from university, going out into an industry that you are inherently passionate about, and your very first day realizing, this is familiar. I understand what is going on here. In fact, I actually have a unique and creative way to solve problems that this organization has been trying to solve for a long time. Working collaboratively is a lot easier when you understand the other people on your team. Systems engineering kind of gives you the skill set to understand your team relationally. Maybe traditionally there was a room just for the electrical engineers, but realistically, engineers are called upon to do such a diverse range of tasks at the moment. Technology is changing so fast that it's important to have a skill set that can be translated or generalized to emerging contexts. These days, computers are an everyday part of every aspect of our lives. Our mobile phones, our cars, our homes, our buildings that we live in. So this, what we call cyber physical field of expertise is really important. And what we really emphasize here is being able to bring that skill set into the engineering design so that you're really kind of future prepared. If we think about engineering as serving society and improving human well-being for all, we kind of incorporate that perspective into all of our systems work and our systems design. So we don't want to think just about a road or a building. We've got to understand, well, how is that interacting with the energy system, with transport systems? And if we move to, you know, autonomous vehicles, what does that mean for our infrastructure design? There's very much that connection between the discipline and the foundational knowledges and that actual kind of impact pathway. Scientific communication, the ability to consider societal and ethical issues. Any engineer working on any project is going to have to work cross-culturally. We have massive problems to be solved, especially with climate change, with our transition to renewables. They're the problems of our time and they're the problems that we're really focused on, both our research and also the education that we're doing here.